Hello again, we're back. Okay, so I've done a few preliminary runs. And what I've got going on here is like, I've got the big top computer over here doing its thing. And then I've got a uh, microphone and headphones and the Mbox audio thing up here. So I guess ideally you'd have two people on the job, but I don't have two people, I have just me. So what I do is I go over there and I hit record and I've got like four bars space. Um, so I have time to sort of like headphones on and just like do the sound check nice and quick. And then I record and then I just loop it and just do a few takes of everything. And then maybe I'll go back and do a few takes of just like a verse or just a chorus. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do that now. Let's go. Yeah. Hit record. And if you have a look, you can just do the shortcut, which is so what I've done, I've kind of gone over the whole song nine times all the way through. Uh, the first four or five times was just kind of like making sure the levels were right. Just playing around with a couple of different things like headphones and microphones and uh, just trying to get it right. So I don't think the like half of those are going to be any good. But I have a lot of stuff to work with. And then I've done about 10 to 15 takes of verse 1. 15 of verse 2, 10 of the bridge, and then what, 12 of the outro, and I'm going to do the chorus a few times. Uh, it's cool because all I need for the chorus is just like one good snippet of each line because it repeats, obviously, so that's what I tend to do. I tend to find the best take and then copy and paste it, and I, I kind of like look for like the perfection and just like really good, just like really tight similarities. I know other people don't care about that kind of stuff as much, but like I will tend to try and make it as the same as possible. So even with the guitar takes and stuff, I used to copy and paste it, do heaps of different takes, but then copy and paste it for the, so the choruses were exactly the same each time, but I know people I've worked with were more prone to kind of just do it like once through. And then if there's a whole take that works, they'd keep that because it kind of makes it a little bit more realistic if it is, if it is a little bit different. But as long as it sounds good, I mean, there's, n I mean, there's generally not like a right or wrong. People tend to, f you know, have their own kind of tendencies when it comes to recording and producing and stuff like that. So that's just mine. I don't really, yeah, I haven't really talked about it. I just kind of do it. Okay, I'm just killing time now. I get to get through this. And then, okay, so I'm just going to finish singing the chorus a few more times. And then I will probably watch an episode of Cora or two. And then I'm just going to edit all this and editing is going through all the takes and finding the right one and then a little bit of tuning and a little bit of just like tightening up of the timing if that needs it uh, okay all right i'm just gonna focus and get this done and then cora and then it's probably like four or five hours okay, nearly there all right let's do this okay i'm done i'm exhausted I'm not as exhausted as i will be when i edit all this stuff so it kind of looks like this what you can do, you can like loop record, so it'll play, and when it gets to the end of this yellow part here, it'll loop again. And when you record, it'll keep it on the same track, but it'll show all the takes here. So it's a really good way to do a lot of a lot of takes, and then you can kind of pick and, and choose the, the ones that suit suit you the best, um, or highlight a little bit of this one, or that word's really good. That word's really good, that word's really good, or kind of work out what is best for you. Um, so that's why the editing process takes such a long time. Just kind of going through and finding out um, like the best parts. Um, and not just the best parts, but kind of like what works well with the other parts. Or Yeah, some felt good, some felt not good. Sometimes you can just even cut and paste like a word that kind of came out really well or just a whole phrase or... And it's mostly cool because, you know, once there's effects and stuff, it's going to sound heaps better. So that's it from me for now. I have had... Fun's the right word. Yeah, fun. It's cool. Just that feeling of hard work and achievements. Um, I just hope it turns out good because sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it does, but it depends who the production team is. Something happens this week, and then I guess I need to get a real job. 
<sighs> or you could share this video with your friends and watch all the ads. I hope you had fun.